And first here tonight, a Washington Township neighborhood breathes a sigh of relief, at least for now. A proposal which would have changed the zoning around the Hither Green, Hither Green Center has been withdrawn. But residents in that area say they're still worried this may not be the final battle. Robert Lowry live to explain the new developments and what's to come for the property. Well, Mark and Kitty, no changes coming to the Hither Green Center, which for now, at least for the foreseeable future, the Hither Green Center remains somewhat of a financial burden for Washington Township. But instead of selling the property, people living in the area are saying that they'd rather see the Hither Green property put to better use. It can often be a quiet road hidden in a northern corner of Washington Township. Matter of fact, when you go out there in the morning, there's deer. Out there, there's foxes. It's really a neat little area. A few people like Brian Feldmeyer hope will only be more inviting. There's no green space or park in that area. And typically in Washington Township, an area that size would have a park or a green space. It's a vision different from a recent proposal to rezone the area where the Hither Green Center sits into a proposed commercial development, all to make way for a nursing facility. It was an unwelcome proposal for those living in the surrounding neighborhoods. On Friday, that proposal was withdrawn by Chapel Development, the group looking to change the Hither Green into a nursing facility. This particular purchase agreement was contingent upon the rezoning, and so there could be other purchase agreements and in the, in the future. Currently, we do not have any other purchase agreements. With no developer lined up, the township is left footing the bill to maintain the Hither Green Center. Feldmeyer, along with others in the area, say they'd rather see more green instead of more traffic. That's our goal. That's what we'd really like to have happen. We'd like to see the building taken down and the area converted to a park or a green space. And as of now, the township says that there are no purchasing agreements lined up for the property, so it still remains in the township's control, but it also remains on the buying list for anyone who wants to come in here and make a change to this property. Reporting live, Robert Lowry, 2 News, working for you.